What's up you guys, my name is Justin. This is Forever Self-Employed. In today's video, we're gonna be doing a hurricane vlog. So I actually posted up a poll on my Instagram. If you don't follow me already, go follow. It's Forever Self-Employed on Instagram. And I asked you guys if you wanted to see a hurricane vlog. Currently, there's like two hurricanes in the Gulf that are headed, I think directly to Louisiana. They might combine, they might not. Uh, but I figured, hey, let's do a vlog. Maybe we'll see what happens. Hopefully I don't get taken away with the hurricanes. We are currently stocked up. We have gotten water, food, most of your essential items. I'll go ahead and show you all some of them here now. So we went grocery shopping. My girlfriend actually organized the pantry. So pantry looks pretty good. We got chips, protein bars. You already know what the deal is. Some dry food, some canned food. Um, and then if we go over here to the fridge, this is a Cribs episode, so obviously we have plenty of condiments. We really need to throw some of these away. We almost have too many condiments here. I mean, I have i don't think I've ever eaten almost any of this. Maybe the mustard, maybe a little barbecue, honey mustard. Y'all know how it is. Y'all know what it is out here. I bought a bunch of eggs. Check that out. You know, you never know if the power goes out. Food supplies are good, obviously. And then I did get some water as well. So I do drink these Essentia waters. So we do have two boxes of these. They go pretty quick. The reason why I like Essentia, however, is because ionized hydration, obviously, um, electrolytes for taste, but here's the biggest reason right here. BPA fluoride and chlorine free. If your water isn't chlorine free, you're in big trouble, buddy. So food check, water check. Um, let's go ahead and give an update on the weather. As of right now, I'm gonna go ahead and walk outside. Everything's pretty clear. Um, skies are clear, I think. The hurricane isn't supposed to make landfall until tonight. Clear skies as of right now, as you guys can see in every direction. Looking good, looking good. So the rain is supposed to come in this evening, like I said. I think either this evening or tomorrow morning. So keep you guys posted. Food, water, check. I think the biggest thing that I'm worried about is losing electricity. So fingers crossed on that we don't lose electricity. And also fingers crossed that people stay safe and uh, no one is harmed by this, of course. But I figured... Why not vlog it and we'll have a good time with it. As much of a good time as you could possibly have with a hurricane, right? I've also been getting a few comments on the beard. Look, if you don't like the beard, that's all good. But people have been telling me I look like a criminal with this thing. You know what I'm saying? It might not be the most shapely, but hey, look, you know what I mean? It gets the job done. The girlfriend's cooking some dinner right now. Let's see what she's got going. A little salmon, some green beans. Come on, bro. Y'all better find you a woman that treats you right. Check this out. I painted this at my uncle's uh, birthday party. Check that out. Finding Nemo. Come on, boy. You didn't know I was gifted with the with the paintbrush in hand. So anyway, I'm about to go grab my equipment out of the garage because the property manager was actually getting on to me about all my equipment. I'll show you guys here in just a second. But I got to go bring it elsewhere. The oven is ready for the fish, obviously. She was like threatening me because I got equipment in the garage, which it's not in anyone's way. And I'll show you guys here in just a second. So I need to prioritize that before these hurricanes hit. I gotta move all this equipment. All right, so this is all the equipment that we have in the garage. Really, you're not supposed to have anything in here. I've been getting away with it for a little while. This is my old roommate stuff. We got some mulch here. Gotta have our tripod to record our jobs. It's got some miscellaneous boxes, pressure washers, of course, double decker right there, surface cleaners. We got gas cans, so. I'm gonna have to clean this up. I think she was making a little bit bigger of a deal out of it than it was. However, we're gonna get it cleaned up looking good. So let's get it. All right, what's up you guys? It is a new day, so it's Tuesday now. Um, so actually last night we were watching the news and it turns out that one of the hurricanes had already passed. It barely rained yesterday. Um, so we made it through one, we survived one. Now it's on to two. Uh, the second hurricane is supposed to hit either later this afternoon or early tomorrow morning i'm not sure but uh mr billy's got a job that we landed in a brand new subdivision and i think we're going to be teaching on the resource page i'm going to get some footage of it and after that we got to finish emptying out the garage because we only got it partially emptied yesterday so let's get it baby all right you guys weather check it's raining right now we're in the middle of a hurricane not really but kind of what do you think jacob is this hurricane weather this is the calm before the real storm <laughs> okay so we just i just got the billies uh we're about to go wash a new house and a new subdivision like i said we're probably gonna be teaching this on the resource page uh mr billy pretty ninja stuff that you're doing here getting new jobs and new neighborhoods hey it's, it's all about the presentation 
the presentation. The presentation. It's all about that. Right. Anybody will get anything clean if you present it correctly. Right. Because it's dirty. They know they need it clean. Exactly. But we just got to point that out to them. So we're not going to give away too much. Uh, we're going to go wash this house. It's raining right now. I didn't bring a damn uh, poncho or nothing. All right, guys. We're about to start on this brand new house. This house is only a few months old. But like we see in a the flyer, these houses are full of... All right, you guys, so one of the cool things I like about coming out here and doing these jobs uh, with Billy and Jacob is because they're working with some really pro rigs. As you guys can see, we got Jacob's rig behind us. Uh, I'm gonna get him to walk us through that in just a second. But uh, yeah, just one of the benefits of me coming out here and seeing them work is their workflow is so much easier. As you guys know, I'm, I'm running around with a four gallon a minute unit, dragging around, hoses all over the place. Uh, Jacob from Apex Pressure Washing, he's gonna walk us through his rig real quick and show us kind of some of the efficiencies that he's got. All right, Jacob, show us what you got, bro. The heart power plant of this wash rig, the Honda GX690, and an auxiliary pump. It pulls between 8 and 12 gallons per minute. A K7 unloader, so it doesn't have as much burst pressure as, um, say, a, a normal uh, rig like this. Atwood 12 gallon fuel tank. I like the simplicity of the fuel gauge. See, right here, we're all good. This will be good for, like, you can run all day. Tank of gas pack, surface cleaner, got a 24 inch general pump, three bar uh, surface cleaner, general pump hose wheel. I mean, this thing's a lifesaver. What I used to do is I had these hooks here and I would have to coil up and twist my hose and, and loop it on these hooks. But now I can show up to the job site, unlock it, just pull the hose and go straight to the back of the house. 275 gallon buffer tank. You don't want to haul 2,000 pounds of water down the road. Well, just hit this dump valve. It's a uh, standard ball valve, you know, like tires to get water out. Now, when I'm traveling down the road, I like to keep an empty tank, keep a light trailer. That's uh, that's a basic rundown of my trailer wash and rig setup. All right, you guys just left Billy's. We're gonna go do a sky check real quick. Looks pretty, pretty dark and ominous. You know, there's a bit of light, a glimpse of hope. Um, no rain yet, so we'll see. All right, you guys, so just got back from working with Mr. Billy a little while ago. He informed me that there is a delay on the hurricane as of right now. It's coming a little bit later on than we expected. Who knows if it'll ever get here? I hope not, personally. But I did finish cleaning out the garage, so Good news, we're not gonna get evicted. I'll show you guys what we got here. So our previous workstation is now no more. However, it's okay, on to bigger and better things. Now we don't have to be kicked out of this place of residence, which is a good thing, right? Looks like it's about to start storming. I'm gonna go take care of some computer work. I'm gonna try to get a couple videos knocked out as well before uh, everything goes down because if we lost power, how would I upload to YouTube? That would be the end of the world. So I'm gonna go ahead and go work on some videos for you guys. All right, you guys, nighttime check-in. Uh, the weather wasn't too bad today. It was like super overcast. Um, like I told you guys earlier, the first hurricane came through, but I heard it turned closer to Texas or something. So didn't touch us. The second one is supposed to be here sometime either tomorrow or Thursday morning. I don't really know. I just know that a bunch of stores and stuff were shut down as we were driving through and a couple places were getting boarded up. So People are getting serious about this thing. Hopefully it's not too bad. I got some stuff I gotta do tomorrow, so hopefully it doesn't interrupt. You know what I'm saying? Nothing worse than a hurricane interrupting your day. Day's wrapping up. I just figured I'd give y'all an update. This hurricane vlog, I don't know how entertaining it's gonna be, but uh, I'm gonna show you what uh, Chef Tiffany is cooked up for dinner. Check this out. Okay, so we got dinner right here. You wanna walk us through what this is? Yes, yeah, so we have a little steak, a little- Why are you getting so quiet? I feel like I'm yelling. Now be loud. You gotta be loud for the camera here, or else it's gonna be real quiet. Okay, well, give me a good introduction to start talking. Here we have Straw some pointer. little garlic parmesan potatoes, some shallot roasted green beans, some steak, and a little reduction sauce. 
I don't even know what that is. Broth concentrate. Didn't you say that this was what uh, HelloFresh or something? Yes, HelloFresh sponsor us. No, I don't know about all that. Give us free meals. <laughs> okay, yeah, that'll be good. <laughs> <laughs> this video is not sponsored by HelloFresh. So okay, <laughs> we're about to try this out. Um, this I guess HelloFresh is one of those uh, meal sending companies where they send you a bunch of meals and stuff. So. Yes, yeah, this is my first time trying it. Maybe we'll do a food review. Who knows? Okay, uh, see you guys in a few. What's up you guys, it's a new day. Um, I'm at the barber shop right now, gotta get a quick haircut. Y'all know how it is, you know. Hurricane's coming, gotta look good. Uh, get ready for that action. I got my barber right here, Blakely. What's Blakely, up? you wanna say hey to the people? So Blakely's gonna uh, make me look really professional and then she's gonna take a photograph of me for her Instagram page. She knows I'm famous and she knew that was gonna get a lot of love, so. Yeah, we're looking forward to that. So She's gonna fade me up righteously. All right, what's up, you guys? I uh, haven't done an update in a little while with regards to the weather. Uh, let's do a weather check real quick. Not looking too bad. However, um, it's been confirmed that the storm is supposed to hit tomorrow morning. I got Billy with me. What's up, guys? <laughs> You're on my channel more than I am now. Hey, a little launch action before we uh, get the heavy winds. That's right. I heard the winds are supposed to be 150 miles per hour uh, okay. coming in. I don't know if they're going to be as bad for us over here, but... Um, definitely in Lafayette right yeah Lafayette's only an hour and a half away so depending on if the storm takes a little bit turn one way or the other it might get bad for us but either way we're gonna have a blast doing it right yeah let's hope so bro <laughs> we gotta be safe out here in these streets so anyway uh we're about to get some chick-fil-a the last the last supper if you will um before the storm and then um that's it i don't know man just get some chick-fil-a <laughs> yeah anything else we want to say mr billy um yeah, maybe if uh, if it gets really bad, we'll show them some footage of that too. Right. So if it gets if it gets real bad, um, we'll get some footage for you guys and let y'all know what's going on. So anyway, inside uh, the eye, inside the eye of the storm with uh, Billy and Justin. Much weather. I'm in Louisiana. We get hit by 150 mile an hour winds. Okay. All right. Sorry about that. Then. Ain't no problem. What's up, you guys? It's been a couple days since the storm passed, and I'm currently editing all the footage. I realize now that I did not get any footage of when the storm was actually here um, or give any updates on it, so I'm going to go ahead and give you guys an update now. Basically, we did get some heavy rain, some heavy winds, but it was not as bad as we initially anticipated. Uh, thank God for that. However, the people in Lafayette did get it terribly, so our thoughts and prayers are with them um, currently because I'm pretty sure they're still out of power, actually, as well. So... I made this vlog just for fun. I hope you guys did enjoy it. If you did, please hit the thumbs up button for me. If you're not already subscribed, please hit the subscribe button. And uh, the word of the day for today's video is going to be hurricane. So if you did make it this far in the video, comment down below hurricane and I'll hashtag you a real one. My name is Justin. This is Forever Self-Employed. And until next time, hustle hard and get that money, baby. Peace.